18 years old already. I cannot just I can't believe it guys. 6570 days I've been born and I probably did a mistake calculating that because of all the fucked up February months, but <clears throat> I tried at least. <laughs> so what's up guys? It's Salty Duran. Uh, this is kind of a commentary for my birthday. I just felt like doing one because I don't know, I just felt like doing one because I'm really happy right now and um I just want to talk to you guys about what's going to happen and what's happening and blah blah blah. So just right before I'm going to talk to you guys about the gameplay. So quickly the gameplay is uh, HK21 Extended Mask with the gold camo on WMD. I found it pretty cool that weapon. I tried to get many montage clips but I always failed and I'm sure that you guys do not give a shit about my perks. So I will spare them for you this time. But only for this time I'm telling you. So. A lot of people don't really know what are the rules exactly in Canada concerning the 18 years old like limit or age. So I'm gonna kind of talk to you guys about a bit about that, and after I'll talk to you guys about how happy I am if I don't forget, and um, maybe talk a bit about what's happening lately. Um, my weird um, sleeping schedule. I've been having a lot of problems sleeping, so I think I'm gonna talk about the sleeping problems first. So yeah, so basically. Um, I think it's probably because I've played too many video games lately since I'm off school. I don't do enough uh, activities or exercise. I try to do one per day, but sometimes I just I'm just too lazy to get out of my chair and just go outside and enjoy the sun. So I'm having a lot of problems sleeping. It's either like I go to sleep at four, I cannot sleep, so I just stay up all night. I go to sleep at 10 a.m., then I wake up at one, or like last night I went to sleep at five. Well, I went in my bed at three. Uh, I went to sleep at 5, like, I closed my eyes and my brain shut off at 5, and I woke up at 6, like, one hour of sleep, and I couldn't sleep anymore after. So it's really weird, really annoying, you guys must be saying, like, oh, that's really funny, you don't have to sleep. Well, it gets really annoying because you're always tired and everything, so I'm really trying to correct that. I just went for a bike ride, and I feel awesome. The sun in my face just feels awesome. I have very very white skin and I don't really like that I would like to go outside more but whatever so enough talking about my problems now let's talk about the good news so basically when you're 18 in Canada you can do everything you want basically you can go buy porn magazines you can buy cigarettes buy alcohol you can go in clubs go in bars you can vote give blood you don't have a pa you don't need a parental signature anymore um, you can go to United States but without proof of your parents that are letting you go because before if you had a car and wanted to go to United States alone or with other friends that are under 17 you need the, you needed a note from your parents allow, allowing you to go alone and that note had to had to be like approved by s someone special like a doctor or, or a lawyer or something like that so sometimes it was really hard to get that paper signed and everything so it was always lazy to go to the United States but I'm coming every weekend in the month of June. Nah, guys, I'm joking. But to be honest, I'm going to go to the United States more often. I'm right across the border from Vermont, Pittsburgh, I'm not Pittsburgh, Plattsburgh, Vermont. Uh, it's about not even like one hour drive. So I'm literally on the border. I'm very close from Vermont. And um, I know Vermont, no offense to people who live in Vermont, but to be honest, Vermont is not really a nice state. Like, like we see Miami on TV, California. All those beautiful states, Florida, and New York City, those all those awesome states and cities are just just look awesome and like Vermont beside of that is just ugly, no offense. So I might come spend, I don't know, sometimes go to Boston. Boston seems to be a nice city, Buffalo maybe. Uh, New York is about six no seven hours away, so um, a lot of people say that it's the best city in the world and a lot of people can confirm that. My good buddy Peo McConnell or Pio Pierre Olivier. Uh, it's his favorite city again from far, and I'm convinced by what he says. So, so basically, you can do all that, and it's really awesome. I'm not gonna do all that the first day. Unfortunately, election just passed, and for those who don't really know, I never really talked about. But I'm really interested in politics, to be honest. Like I follow that. I follow like not the debate, but I I don't really read newspapers, but I just follow the parties and everything, because politics in Canada is really different from the United States. We do not have a president, we have a prime minister, and on top of the prime minister you have a governor that does absolutely nothing, and over of that over that you have the queen. The queen doesn't do anything, it's just like a symbol, but why am I talking about politics to be honest? Politics. So, 
um what are the plans for when i'm 18 to be honest i really don't know i'm probably gonna be playing xbox when i'm gonna turn 18 at midnight and um, i'm usually never excited for birthdays usually like okay birthdays are fun because you receive gifts but, like this is intense like take your 21st a birthday and your 18th birthday of it in the United States put it together and that's how awesome it is or take all your teenager birthdays like 13 14 15 16 17 put them all together there you have your excitement for your 18th birthday so uh, what are my plans tomorrow I, I'm, I'm just to be honest gonna do what I want to do like sort of I, I love some things in life like a lot I love driving driving is one of my passions um, like not racing driving just driving the street having your window down music uh, some good music in the Sun just riding everywhere downtown I loved going downtown I'm really a guy that loves the, the city and everything um, I'm gonna go take of course go take a drink and go party a bit with my friends in a bar at, at night since I am allowed um, just do stuff that I really want to enjoy and play a bit of Xbox when I wake up but not too much because I'm not going to do that the day after my birthday. Maybe read comic books because I'm in love with comic books. So I received a bit of my gifts. I don't like being cocky or anything, but I just want to tell you guys a, a bit of my gifts because they aren't a lot, but they mean a lot to me. Uh, nice triple spray right there. But um, I got some iTunes gift cards. Uh, you guys know that I study in arts, so arts like arts, uh, arts in general are so big. Like you have music, comic books, tattoos. Uh, paintings, music, um, oh, so many things are in arts, uh, theater, movies, and everything. So I really respect art in general, and I respect the artist. So I, I another triple spray. So I like buying, buying like pieces of art. So uh, one of my dreams is actually to buy uh, a page of a comic book that the author did like on hand because of course he does it on hand then he photocopies it in the computer then they print it so I really want to buy one for my favorite artist he's called Michel Rabagliati it's a French comic I actually received two yet I think I'm gonna receive a third one because I didn't open all of my gifts but uh, it's probably my favorite comic book I'm gonna leave a link below to his website um, I think it's translated like in four languages and four comic book made in Quebec that is awesome it just basically uh, tells the life of, of the author and how he came there and everything it's mostly a uh, kind of comic book more for adults like it's really developed and everything it's not like uh, Asterix or Scooby-Doo or whatever so um, that's pretty much it yeah iTunes gift cards I got some comic books of course a bit of money um, I'm, I'm not really gonna offer anything to myself for my birthday like I usually do I think I bought enough stuff like Dirt 3, I'm having so much fun and everything. Uh, my apartment is one of my gifts that I do to myself, so just go and just go on living in another city is going to be great. So uh, I think this commentary is wrapping up, let me check, yeah we're at 8, 8.15. So hope that you guys enjoyed and guys just enjoy life, enjoy your 18th year old birthday and for those in, in the United States also enjoy your 21st. And um, yeah, so I hope that you guys enjoyed and I love y'all and I want to thank you all for uh, just viewing my video and for those who stayed until the end, thank you for, so much for listening to me. I love doing commentaries and I will continue and the last year has been intense and um, YouTube was one of those intense factors and I, I'm loving YouTube right now. Not like not YouTube but making videos are, is so fun. I wish I could post like 10 per day, I have 10 videos every day. So. That's pretty much it, guys. It's going to wrap up very soon. I hope you guys enjoyed and just enjoy life. And that's pretty much it, guys. I love you. No homo. All homo. No homo. No homo. All homo. No homo.